Hey everybody, I'm joined here by Michael Shermer from the Skeptic Society, Skeptic Magazine, and as I now understand, every single TAM that has happened thus far, is that correct? Yeah, that's right, all ten of them. Very nice. So tell me a little bit about uh, your experience at TAM. What is it that you enjoy most about this conference? Uh, mostly the socializing with fellow like-minded skeptics and hanging out and trying new ideas. You know, usually my books uh, are generated from lectures that I give, and so I try out new ideas here and get uh, good critical feedback. So there's that. And then, um, you know, of course, the magic and the entertainment is part of it as well. And always the great speakers, always good speakers. Now, are you part of any panel discussions, or are you speaking this year? Uh, I am. I'm the keynote opening speaker tomorrow morning. The Moral Arc of Science. Moral Arc of Science. Keynote yes. opening speaker. You can see who has not checked the schedule recently, <laughs> folks. And then I'm on a panel shortly thereafter, something about the future of skepticism, I think, or something like that. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so anyway, this is fun. It's a great, great event. Very nice. And now, what, uh, what's going on with the Skeptic Society and Skeptic Magazine lately? Well, our newest project is Skepticism 101. That is um, teaching skepticism in classrooms. How to take skepticism to the you know, middle schools, high schools, colleges. Um, so the program is for really for teachers, especially not just students, but teachers, educators, where we provide a lot of free material: um, lectures, PowerPoint, keynote presentations, videos, uh, reading lists, articles. Uh, student projects, you know, just hundreds and hundreds of things that are on there now to download for free uh, so that teachers can construct their own course in Skepticism 101, whatever they call it, um, depending on the school that they're in. And, uh, and, and But the idea is, is to teach critical thinking, teach people how to think. That's our thing. Why is it, do you suppose, I noticed that when I graduated from college, at one point I looked back and realized that critical thinking skills and interpersonal skills are probably the two most valuable skills that I've had to use in life, yet you didn't learn any of those in school. Yeah, I know. It's uh, it's amazing. <laughs> you would think that that's like, you know, introduction to life is what this really is, uh, because you're going to be bombarded with nonsense, so how to think about, you know, weird things and nonsense. So that's the key. Now, if teachers want to get a hold of some of this stuff and find out more about it, where should they go? Skeptic.com. Very nice, skeptic.com. Thank you very much for joining us. You're welcome.